Hello guys, well, what is up? My name is Dan the Light and today I am bringing you a Eugenie La Summer FC24 player review. This is the 86 rated striker, um, 5 foot 3, medium high on the work rates, very strange for a striker. Um, 4 star skill moves, 5 star weak foot, right footed and controlled. I really have no idea why that's medium high on the work rates to be honest. Uh, striker, centre forward or left wing, so it's not even like she can play like central mid or anything like that. Um, 80 pace, um, 79 acceleration, 80 sprint speed, 87 shooting with 88 finishing 91 attack positioning 88 shot power really really good as far as the shooting goes the pace is a little bit low 80 on the passing 84 short pass will make that feel a bit better than what it is 84 vision is nice as well with 82 curve 87 dribbling with 86 reactions 89 ball control 89 dribbling defending 89 head and accuracy which is mad for someone that's actually very short um but the rest of it is she's a striker and then 77 strength not bad at all 73 physical 87 jumping but yeah, not bad, not bad. Um, and then three play styles, power shot, uh, first touch, and the technical. So let's get in some gameplay with her. All right, so we've got La Summer here playing as a striker for me. Hopefully she performs well. Um, first half of this game, she missed so many chances, not going to lie. There were so many. I mean, he's got to stay getting goal, who has been the bane of my life pretty much in this whole FIFA, or EAFC, sorry. We get the goal there with Wilson. Um, but yeah, Summer, I mean, not missed. Missed is probably the wrong word. She had so many say, um, shots saved, but they're ones that I feel like one really good enough to trouble a keeper i i don't think that it was purely because it was test again maybe one of them might have gone in but she had like seven or eight shots like no, no i'm not exaggerating and uh, didn't score a goal so hopefully she gets a goal at least in the second half we're having lots of chances it's just his keeper is immense and then that on top of summer's uh finishing perhaps not being as good as what i would have thought um wilson's managed to get both the goals for me and here he is again actually in a good position you see last summer there just getting into the box there just way behind the pace um, of the match and that seems to be a thing that here she is the seat there we go um, that's pretty much the sort of things that's been happening uh, all of the first half as well but there were some that were easier opportunities than that let's just say um, so yeah as I said hopefully that won't be the case in this one I don't actually remember how this match ends I th I th yeah we'll see um, but yeah as I say in these videos i will always play uh four or five games with each of the players just so that we can give a, a proper gauge of how they perform so i think this was the second game that i played with her i don't think she did an awful lot in the first game either um so yeah she really needs to do something in this half really otherwise my opinion of her is going to be fairly low going into the last few games that i'm going to try but um yeah i'd put chemistry style on there to increase the hawk is looking good for me i think for for her um increase that pace increase the shoot in which seems to be needed a little bit um and the physical as well yeah the pace is definitely needing a little bit of a boost but there's wilson exploding away look at her she she's getting into the box now finally not quite i oh, didn't quite get there i mean over overshot the run in the end but yeah it was just un, not in the pace of the game which is really a shame that's not what you want for a striker that's not going to help you at all um so yeah i mean i don't know why i bought my keeper out here I think he has a shot here. No, he doesn't. I thought he was going to shoot from there, and I thought he hit the bar, but that must have been a different game or earlier in this game, something like that. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's just not really getting opportunities. She had the goal or the chance on goal, and that's pretty much what she was like all of the first half. Um, so it's a real shame. He's just absolutely done me there. This guy is not a good player. I should be winning this game. I hate the games like this. Like if if a player is clearly a lot better than you and you're drawing or losing, then fair play. But this guy, I feel like, is there for the taking, just not managing to get past. Um, um, to Sturgeon um, and last summer is a big part of that so not great but we'll see we'll see if she comes good she might if she scores the winner then <laughs> you know she's going to be a, a hero for me and it, actually here we go there oh another one see there the, that's the sort of thing she did about six or seven of those in the first half one-on-ones should end up in the back of the net from there um you would imagine with someone that can finish so it is a shame i don't really know what's going on there um keeper throws it out here we actually i think we score with her i'm pretty sure i remember this passage of play there. i remember the keep thinking why is the keeper just throwing it straight out like that yep here we go let's sum up gets to go all right so you've seen her in action there and i think very much to be honest that the play styles did kind of kill the card a little bit medium high you saw her quite regularly being behind where we needed it to be 
and it kind of felt like that in all of the games that I played. Um, sadly, I was hoping that it wouldn't be the case. 80 pace, yeah, I think that probably feels about right, sadly. Can't be increased there. Um, the pace just didn't feel very good at all, uh, if I'm going to be honest. 87 shooting, I can't say that 87 shooting feels right either. Um, you saw her miss quite a few opportunities there. There was loads, though. She did score some, like, obviously. Um, when you got 87 shooting, you're bound to score some, but she missed way too many attempts that she had on goal. So 87, I'm going to have to bring that down to an 85. Uh, 80 passing, I'll leave as 80. Didn't notice that she did anything outstanding, but nothing bad either. 87 dribbling. Now, this was definitely the standout for this card. The dribbling was brilliant. 87 feels about right. Really good dribbling. Uh, 87 is a good score. 44 for the defending. Yeah, I would probably say that that feels... Fine, I mean, she's a striker. I know that she went back a lot, but still, 89 head and accuracy. I didn't test out any header in. Um, so, yeah, we'll leave that as 44. And then 73 for the physical. You know what? That could probably be increased. I didn't notice that she was getting pushed off the ball particularly. Um, and her dribbling was good. I'm going to bring the physical up to a 78, which is quite a, an increase. But it's the shooting. The pace is low as it is. The shooting coming down. I can't really say that this card is worth doing. I know it's not actually a very expensive SBC whatsoever, and I suppose you are getting an 86 rated player, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't put her in my team. I can't use her. So hopefully you did like the video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more videos like this. There will be a link in the description down below full of FC24 player reviews. As always, guys, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.